I mean, they said that the character from the last episode uh, who was talking to Twilight was um, Sunset and Starlight's kid, so... No, they didn't. I thought Big no. Jim, I thought Big Jim said That actually works. <laughs> I agree. Yo, don't be talk- don't- Yo, all I care about him is my girl Star- Starlight and Shimmer with her fucking beanie cap and woman to her. That's all I care about, brother! You wear a baby cap, you're officially cool! You can also, it took, talk with you! Also, it took them nine seasons to make friggin' permanent changes to characters like aging and progress. I just wish they didn't have to arbitrarily put bags under the eyes of all of the characters who were younger and are now older. It's just, well, it's like, because they're tired you... with this shit! <laughs> how do you know? Well, how else are you supposed to know that they're older? Obviously. Yeah, they're like... They're like make in their them, or something. I don't know, make, make them slightly taller. Big or... droopy horse tits. <laughs> yeah, cause you know how like, time, time goes on, you just get taller? It's like at the age of 90, I'm gonna be a fucking, fucking giant. No, I don't mean like that. I mean like, they could signify the character's ages through something that isn't just everyone just has bags under their eyes and is tired all the time. Oh, you mean like Applejack wearing uh, Granny Smith's scarf because Granny Smith fucking died? Yeah, Jesus. I was yeah. about Apple Bloom wearing a uh, mm. uh, Golden Deliciouses thing. Yeah. <laughs> Not a lot of people caught on to that, but we caught that. She's fucking dead. Yeah. yeah she's actually fucking dead. gone. Let that process. She was... I have an Apple Family Tree, like, fucking, like, Apple Family Tree poster in my room. I get it out of the frame and I put a big fucking X on Granny Smith. So, how, how <laughs> I, I forget, how old was fucking Granny Smith again? Too so old. Fucking, <laughs> too fucking old. <laughs> she was like At 390. Fucking, she was like she'd 300 years or some shit, she'd right? She'd always been there. At if you could somehow years. put her on a, on a scale that measures age, it would just keep going up and up and up and never stop going. It's over 9,000. <laughs> it would be over 9,000. 9,000. Oh, Granny Smith could be older than Celestia for all we fucking know. Probably. <laughs> I subscribe to that. Ah, oh, shit. This <laughs> Granny Smith wants to be there when we're in Equestria. Psych, it's Granny Smith. <laughs> well, I mean. You cannot fucking convince me otherwise. I mean, considering everything she went through while seemingly just refusing to succumb to age and die, she probably is the most powerful character in the show. Oh, right. can we write a fanfic where Granny Smith uh, fights Celestia and Granny Smith wins? Just out of pure <laughs> determination. Can we write a fic that's just Granny Smith is Saitama? <laughs> She's one punch mare. <laughs> that's what she oh, is. God. Exactly. I was, about, I was about to say one buck mare, but... Mm... Oh, I like your idea better. I like your idea better. One buck mare. Mm. Oh. One buck mm. mare. One fuck's all you're gonna get because your pelvis is gonna be broken, kid. Uh, <laughs> that's all you're getting. Mm. All you're getting is a shattered pelvis and broken dreams. Also, what do you guys think about dreams. the fucking, like... What do you guys think about the whole Rara Jack thing? Everyone's saying dreams. that Rara Jack is totally canon. I don't know what... Yeah, I, I think... Know. I think they implied it enough where it could be, but they also left it alone enough that it couldn't be. There I we mean, go. I yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. I feel like that was the intention, is just you can draw your own conclusions from it. Draw, draw what? Sorry, I zoned out. For, I, for I who? I wouldn't be surprised if Rainbow Jack and fucking, fucking Jack and fucking Rainbow, Rainbow Jack. Jack. What the fuck? Rainbow God Jack. <laughs> Yeah, you know, like Twilight, oh, Rarity, and Rainbow Jack. He's getting Rainbow Jack. Is <laughs> yeah, getting Rainbow so Jack really just fast. when you? Is, is getting Rainbow Jack just when you're invited to the threesome with them? Yeah. So like getting it. Rainbow Jack is. Oh I mean, I totally wouldn't mind getting Rainbow Jack. Just saying. <laughs> also, Fair I just enough. realized I said Rara Jack by mistake, and I do feel like an idiot. Oh, I feel. Idiot I, I feel sufficiently below average intelligence. Oh, I read at a second grade level! <laughs> I don't even read. I'm only reading a webcomic now because I have fuck all else to do. It's a nice webcomic. Good. Two how the fuck, what the fuck's geometry and how do I solve it? <laughs> Where the fuck's my kazoo? <laughs> how is a kazoo the tell of this? I'm not asking this question. I'm not asking this question because I chucked my happened. kazoo against the wall in frustration and it went like off the wall and landed in my Hey! 
Oh, well, I, I don't know what you were expecting. I wasn't expecting to pull off a pro gamer move like that. <laughs> Gamers rise up. Mitch Shad oh. Gamer. Ginger Pale just said that Mountain Dew is gross. Ah! Gamers rise. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna shoot myself Sorry, in the foot. Daughter. I think I've only ever had Mountain Dew like once or twice, and I don't remember it being. Well, you I need to remember something. So much. Mountain Dew UK is different than the Mountain Dew we talk about in America. Like, they're owned by the same brand, but, like, for one thing, the color is not great. And in the UK, it's apparently marketed as an energy drink, whereas in the US, it's just a soda. Mountain Dew was originally created as a syrup to be mixed with moonshine. Mountain Dew literally just means moonshine. Yeah, no, 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 I remember that. I remember that, yeah. And actually, believe it or not, I have yeah. mixed moonshine Mountain Dew. It's actually amazing. Oh, yeah, it is. Wow, Talk it's almost... It blends... It's, it's almost like... Yeah, I know, I know. It blends together. It was that... No, no, but it, it counters all the harshness of moonshine. Like, perfectly. Damn. For that purpose. You know no, it was, is. but I'm surprised at how well it is. Rather than just tasting good, it tastes the synergy is like way better than you think it has a right to be. Is what I'm saying. I just synergized. Like, I like the story of Seven Up. I love the story, like the success story of Seven Up. It used to have like this mood enhancement drug inside of it, which is the why it became popular because it was released around the stock market crash in 1920. I mean, to be fair. I'm pretty sure a lot of sodas were founded because uh, drugs were a core ingredient. It's just, yeah. it's just that Seven Up. Are you guys depressed because all your money's gone? So are we. Buy Seven Up. <laughs> I mean, didn't Coca-Cola have legitimate cocaine? Yes, it had yes. coca leaf yeah. extract. Yeah. Aw, oh, did somebody get addicted to cocaine? <laughs> if you're in my town, because that's what you say. That's what you say to somebody having a drug problem. Oh, are you you having a little drug problem? Oh, you fucking go to Oh, Cedrus, I might look into that. You'll have to tell me all about it. I mean, I mean, it was originally designed as a like a cure for morphine addiction. Mm. Are you sick of ha of being addicted to morphine? Fucking drink Coca-Cola, you dipshit. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Pepsi was also Pepsi was also made as a dietary aid. Like it was supposed to be a digestional aid. And to be fair, I've oh. seen Pepsi strip the rust off of steel beams, so I believe that. <laughs> Pepsi can Pepsi. melt steel beams. It was also originally <laughs> called Brad's drink. Well, no, there's another thing about it too. Believe it or not, believe it or not, if you get original recipes for like Coke and Pepsi, there's a reason why the, the reason why they taste slightly oh God. different is oh God. because. Pepsi was developed before refrigeration, and Coke was developed after. So yeah, Coke so was actually designed to be consumed cold, but Pepsi was designed to be drunk at room temperature. Yep. Yep. <sighs> That's my favorite. I love that somebody else knows that piece of pop trivia. I oh God! Pop trivia. Ah! Like, Jesus. Root beer, um, actually, root beer actually used to have beer in it, but the guy who made it. Paul ass. Oh my God. Are you oh, are you having a good deep. fucking time, Bliss? Bliss, you sound you sound like you're having an encounter with Stan the T-Rex, and you don't have enough lube to pull it out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is it a bad time to mention that what? I found I found something on Bad Dragon with my name on it? Oh. Oh no. Is it I, called Vlad the Impaler? No, Is it's it called Vlad the Triceratops. <laughs> oh my God. Ooh. I mean, I was sent an image of uh, some stuff on Bad Dragon that also had my name on it. <laughs> so, and, you want to know, know the thing that's even worse? But, it was also in my character's colors. So, uh, <laughs> you know what that no. means, Solar? What? We have to buy that shit, and at the next convention, we bring liquid gold and we fucking killed it to carry around with us as a trophy. Jesus. <laughs> oh, God! Okay. Jesus! Okay, uh... What the fuckers are there? Are you oh, having God. fun, Bliss? No! Solar, are you no, even... Gaming. Solar, are you even watching the fucking game? Yes, I am! We are gonna get 911 called on us hardcore now. Alright, let's shut up. Stop breaking your chunks fucking teeth. <laughs> well, maybe they should stop trying to fucking eat them. Hey, I don't have to worry about having the cops call on me because I live alone, and my walls are hella thick. Thick-ass walls, bro. Thick-ass wall, gang. Thick-ass walls. 
They are it probably doesn't help that I made that art piece of Bliss's baby Mario, and so I'm just imagining I'm gonna get eaten alive because Golden Fox can't run his ass off. <laughs> you know, now that you, you know what, Bliss? Now that you mention it, I now have a mental image of my character as Yoshi running and hauling ass, and you're fucking like screaming like, ah, big chain jump after me! No, 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 no even better, Golden, even better. <clears throat> Must go faster. Must go faster. Must go faster. Go 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 go. Oh no! Where did the green platform go? It was right the fucking there. I didn't see the red platform until I died. Let it move. No, the green. No, the green platform was underneath you, moving in the same direction. And then it disappeared. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on! We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here now. Now, right now! Come on, come on! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! It feeds you. It feeds you. It's been a while since I've heard that. Let it flow through you. I remember the old limbo memes. I'm hip, I'm cool, I remember shit. I remember much of I don't remember much of anything else, but I remember the memes. The dank mames. The dank mames. I remember the I remember the Temple of Champions for those who beat British Ninja's shitty fucking game. Oh, oh yeah, my no. god, I remember <laughs> that. I, I was, yeah, so no, angry. I was a part of, like, the original five people that beat that game, so I made this chat called the Temple of Champions for people that had beaten it. Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> and I, I remember, like, I was screaming and shit. My mom could hear me on the fucking bottom floors. You could hear me in the living room. Well, that game was... I also ascended past too. all of you. I went to the next level, and I beat Bennett Foddy's getting over it, so... <laughs> all right, Solar. Listen, we all understand that you have a huge this. fucking monster cock with a magnum, like, magnum condom, so you don't need to fucking show it off to the rest of us. <laughs> I have ascended, fools. <laughs> you go even further. You got it wrong. He doesn't have it. grow stronger. You cowards will never stop me. This is so fucking intense. Fucking, he doesn't have a monster cock, he has an ascendant cock. Vlad, I am so glad that I brought you into this call. You're <laughs> welcome. Ascendant dog. Listen, man, I have been fucking, I have been fucking, like, dying of isolation ever since I said goodbye to you fuckers at BC-19. That's what Oryx should call his dreadnought, the fucking ascendant dog. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Man. Hey Vlad, you wanna hear the one being that actually causes Adora Beas to everybody? Oh fuck. I listen, I can only deal so much. I put like nine like nine spoonfuls of sugar into my coffee, and I've had three cups. Nine! Of Jesus! I put three! Oh, yeah, brother. Taste the bitterness. Well put it we'll put it like this. If you have so much coffee that you can't feel your face, you can survive whatever the day has to throw at you. I think you killed him. Oh god, oh god, you fucking, you fucking my heart. Up. My heart. You sounded, you sounded like your teeth just Thanos from the Adorabeus. Uh, no, my heart started legitimately- Ah oh, crap, okay, so it's one of these. This is a thing that happened nope. back in like the old days of Limbo. I got diagnosed with like a heart condition, and it left me with tachycardia. I I had an attack like what maybe two wow. like a month ago. Wow, are you kidding me right now? And it's like my heart is beating faster than it should because of that. Oh god. Hey! <laughs> children, I swear, children are gonna be the death of me. <laughs> Fuck them kids. Oh. You definitely will be the- She would definitely be the death of you, cause she gets golden every time! Uh, yeah. My heart. My fucking heart, man. At least you're not- At least you're not singing anymore. <laughs> Don't get- Being exposed to that song you guys came up with so many times is one of the reasons I despise singing. <laughs> that and I can't Wait, sing. <laughs> oh! You, Wait, you know the song. Don't pretend the rainbows, don't. rainbows, Twinkie no. is awake, clap your hooves. Oh, the rainbow rhyme, yeah. I fucking hate Nicole. Excuse me. <laughs> I feel like I'm out of the joke here. What the fuck kind of heresy did I just listen in on? Okay. <laughs> Bliss, <laughs> Bliss and I made our own rhyme. Yeah. The good it's okay. An, it's your kid is gonna kill me. Your kid's gonna. This is where I die. <laughs> I, everybody in chat is going to hear me die. Your, your kid is gonna kill me. <laughs> your kid's gonna kill me. Everybody in chat is gonna watch me die on stream. Like they're gonna be able to hear me. <laughs> they're gonna hear you croak. 
the last thing you, yeah. the last thing you guys are gonna hear from me is just fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Oh fuck! Oh shit! I think he, guys. I think I think he's actually gone. Oh shit! Oh, Cedrus, you asked a very good question. Is there a legit song that I hated from MLP? Yes. Awesome as I want to be from Rainbow Rocks. Yes. There we go. <laughs> Just pure fucking ego and narcissism. I am awesome as I want to be. Okay. <clears throat> I win. I wish that Snips and Snails had actually done a better job rapping. I was hoping for, like, the emergence of Biggie and Tupac and... <laughs> <laughs> We're witnessing rap in its prime right now.